goddamn thing. Stay cool. We'll get through this. Motherfuckers. How about we finish this? Danny and Ellis just came through with the drill. Hot damn, Ellis. What took you cats so long? Piece of shit drill kept overheating. You and Lincoln both still in one piece? Yeah, we good. Where's Danny? He's pushing everything off to the side so that we have room to catch the money. All right, well, once you square the way up here, we start dropping it down. We'll make it quick. Motherfuckers killed the lights. Just worry about the money. I'll deal with this. Trying to flush us out. Stay focused on what you're doing. God damn, you gotta be deaf enough to hear that. Here he is! Lock this place down. Looking for cover! Those guards will cut us down the second we make a break for it. Tell Danny he needs to get us out of here. And these bastards got us pinned down. Y'all need to figure something out. I got some TNT. I'll put on our side of the hole and detonate it. What the fuck is that gonna accomplish? With any luck, it'll blow a hole big enough for y'all to drop down. With any luck, Danny, do you even know what the fuck you're doing? Come on, it's dynamite. How complicated could it be? It's lit. Get the fuck away from the hole. No one really knows why Sal Marcano turned on Thomas Burke, uh, but he took Point Verdun from him and gave it to an enforcer named Roman the Butcher Barbieri, who promptly busted up one of Burke's legs. Now, Danny Burke was part of the heist crew. I mean, he was a gearhead, had never done anything like this before, but Thomas Burke insisted. He figured if the heist was a success, Sal would forgive him and return Point Verdun. Penetrator, all right. <laughs> hey, now I heard there ain't nothing sweeter than Vietnamese pussy. You tell me it's true. 
Casanova Clay. Shit, man, it's so fucking good to see you. You too, Danny. That's Nikki. God, she wanted to be here, but I ain't remember how old. Oh, God damn, you piece of shit. Yeah, unfortunately. Come on, let's grab a beer. Wait for the old man to chill out, and then we can get down to it. Yeah. What's up, man? You already got it all set up and organized. All the girls gonna be there and everything, except we just gotta go in my cars, because we can't roll up in that beat-up piece of shit outside. <laughs> oh, you didn't just call my all-American machine a beat -up. I'm just saying, there better rides out there. Hey, bullshit there are. This car's a beast. I dropped the custom 358 in before we shipped out. That ain't the only thing you dropped in there. Maybe you should tell them about how you'd borrow it from Ellis and take the ladies for a ride. <laughs> Hell, man, leave me out of this. Wait, did you fuck in my car? Mm -hmm. Nah, it ain't no big deal. I was always wrapped up tight. <laughs> Besides, I already got one fucking bass in my life. I don't need another one. All right, you know what? You're going to clean it. Not just the back oh. seat. Every square inch. <laughs> I don't need to be riding around sitting in your shit. Hey, and you, funny man, you going to fucking help. Like a hell I am, shit, I didn't get any. Yeah, well, it's just new. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus Christ, you fucking jokers got about as much chance of pulling this off as I do at winning a goddamn decathlon. Oh, all right, Dad, we hear you. <laughs> Danny and Ellis, you're gonna use the drills to cut a hole up through the bottom of the vault. You and Georgie, you'll be inside. You're gonna drop the money down, then get the hell out of there. That goddamn drill ain't easy to move, though. So we need a boat, to get it through the canals and into position. Well, Ellis and I worry about the boat. See, George's old man flipped the guard at the reserve, giving you his truck. <laughs> Between that and the uniforms, and no one gonna give us a second look. <laughs> Come on, let's get moving. We still gotta swing by Skeletters and finish up some prep work. Hey, and you two assholes, don't think this gets you off the hook when it comes to my car. Y'all best get ready to clean it. I ain't cleaning shit. Hey, you cleaning it. My father.